Hey folks, uh, welcome to this week's Song for Sunday, and it's uh, Matthew Bridges, Crown Him With Many Crowns. I think it was from about 1851, from the middle of the 19th century anyway. Uh, it's, it's a wonderful hymn, it's a wonderful hymn. Um, Hark how the heavenly anthem drowns all music but its own. Awake my soul. You know, people talk about being woke or awakened. Well, we believe in being woke in the sense of being awakened, but spiritually awakened. Awake my soul and sing of him who died for thee and hail him as thy matchless king through all eternity. I love this. Crown him the Lord of life who triumphed o'er the grave and rose victorious in the strife for those he came to save. His glories now we sing who died and rose on high who died eternal life to bring and lives that death may die. The, um, when we're going through Revelation, tomorrow we're going to be looking at Revelation chapter uh, 12, verses 11 and 12, and it talks about Satan being fallen down and the believers knowing that life is going to continue. Isn't this beautiful words? Crown him the Lord of life. Behold his hands and side, rich wounds yet visible above in beauty glorified. No angels in the sky can fully bear that sight, when, but downward bends their burning eye at mysteries so bright. Crown him the Lord of years, the potentate of time, creator of the rolling fears, ineffably sublime. Ineffably sublime. I, I just, I love it. I love the words. All hail, Redeemer, hail, for thou hast died for me. Thy praise shall never, never fail throughout eternity. It's just a great worship song that focuses on Christ, and yet because it focuses on Christ as we sing it, it lifts us up also. So here are those St. Peter's folks singing it. Um, enjoy, sing along, worship the Lord our God. Crown him with many crowns. See you next week. Bye. Mm -hmm.